heaped on India. There are deals, dosti, diplomacy, all of it staying at the iconic Blair House, which is expected uh, for the Prime Minister. Also, he is going to be getting a 21 gun salute. He will be welcoming many of the firsts which are going to be coming in for the Prime Minister's visit. Times Now is in Washington, D.C., getting you minute by minute updates. Watch this report. I am in Washington, D.C., and right behind me is the Blair House. Typically, dignitaries visiting the President of the United States of America stay at this location. Several world leaders, such as Queen Elizabeth II, Vladimir Putin, as well as Prime Minister Narendra Modi, have stayed at this location in the past. During his upcoming visit to the United States of America, it is not yet confirmed where Prime Minister Modi will stay. But this location is likely to be an epicenter of activity. Next week, we'll be honored to have him address a joint meeting of Congress, underscoring the significance of the relationship between the United States and India. The bond between India and the United States is not just an alliance. It is a st strategic and global partnership. Our two nations' relationship is built on the strong foundation of shared values, democracy, freedom, and respect for the rule of law. U.S.-India diplomatic relations have only grown since India gained its independence 75 years ago. And I want to welcome Prime Minister Modi to Washington, D.C., and thank him for his visit to our country. The relationship between the U.S. and India is a strong and critical relationship. We have a strong economic partnership. We are strong strategic partners. India is the world's largest democracy and a crucial part of the world. And we are working together on many important issues, not the least of which is climate change and building towards a clean energy future. And we are also really excited because of the large Indian American population that we have in the U.S. and in the Ninth District. The Indian diaspora is a crucial part of our country. So I look forward to strengthening the relationship between the U.S. and India. Well, if you want to know what's happening in the U.S. as the Prime Minister is all